Good morning. Hello. This is June the 30th. It's 1033. I've already been out working. I'm already breaking a sweat. And it is god awful humid. What's the humidity out there, you reckon? Yeah, probably about 60%. So, anyhow, <clears throat> I was wa watching the Black Fork Lawn and Snow. And, um, you know what he did? He took and bent on a yard and didn't figure it was high enough, so he did a half job. And the guy loaded his mail up with messages. Right now it's 82% humidity. 82%. It's wet, it's like swimming. Anyways, uh, so he said. <laughs> He said that the guy said he was not happy. He said he didn't get much pay for it. He only charged 50 bucks. Well, that's just inexperience. That's but right. But you should still do a good job whether you... We've all or, been there. I mean, we paid it a deck for 20 bucks. We've all been there. <laughs> and it took us two days. And I did it. And we've all been there. And I was sunburned up like you would not believe. We had three little kids at the time, remember? <laughs> yeah, okay. Here's here's what I'm going to tell all you guys in the lawn care business. The new guys and the old guys. I smell skunk. Do you smell skunk? Make a drink. That's not skunk. Anyways, I'm going to tell all of you all something I learned a long time ago. Set your standards. Set your standards and bid accordingly. I actually have yards that I go bid on and the people say, does uh, weed eating and, and blowing off come with that? Or no, how much extra is it for weed eating and blowing off? I said, look, when I mow, I weed eat and blow off. That's part of it. I don't bid those kind of things separate. So anyhow, I'm sure that that uh, he learned now. Set your standards, and I know we're always concerned, especially the new guys, concerned about losing work. So you try to bid it to get it, and you bid so low, and you get into it, and you think, "Oh crap, I ain't getting enough to do all this." If you don't get every job, that's okay. So bid it, look at all the work you need to do, figure out how long it's going to take you to do your kind of work. Um, we can't get every job out there. Uh, some of them are over our head, some of them are just junk, some of them are not, some of them we just don't want, some of them are just too picky. I mean, we, that's the glory of working for yourself. You don't have to take everything. So while you did that fifty dollar job, someone else did. Yes, somebody else did a two hundred dollar job, and they got paid good for their quality of work. That job you did, if it was a one timer, and world growed up, they wouldn't have seen me there for less than one hundred and fifty bucks gonna go mow a yard today that probably is gonna be that we're gonna go mow a yard today if I don't someone, know how bad I shave it in but they someone, said it's pretty bad if someone's about to get a ticket something like did get a ticket they got a notice on their door when you get said, a notice you have 10 days to mow it she... okay somebody called and said they wanted me to mow a yard over here we're going to walk it, make sure there's nothing in there that's going to damage my mower. This grass here has gotten so high that it's laid over. There's rock right there. 
There's a tarp right here. This is very, very, very thick. Chunks of wood and logs. I'm not going to try to get that right now. I'm just going to get what's obviously looked like it's been mowed in the past. Looks like there's a, a path back here where somebody's been walking. Okay. Very bad. There's obvious limited to what I can make it look like today. It's just too high. I'll probably be here for quite some time trying to get it looking halfway decent. This side of the house too. Got to be real careful.
Well, it's 4.30, and we got rained out. That was okay. We only have one more to do anyhow. Mm. It's raining hard, praise God. We need that rain to keep the grass growing. And you guys, look at that rain. It is coming down. Look, we got a flash flood here, man. Good grief. Yeah, I know it. Look at the whirlpool over there. See the whirlpool right there? Okay, honey, sing us a song. Well, thank you, honey. That was so sweet. I love you so much. Thanks for showing up, you guys. And I uh, hope you have a nice day.